when Ryan Reynolds offered his opinion on who might have leaked the Deadpool test footage in 2014, he said, I'm 70% confident it wasn't. Before the studio canceled Deadpool, Ryan Reynolds was the only supporter. That is, up until the infamous test footage leak in 2014. Without a doubt, Ryan Reynolds is one of Deadpool's biggest supporters from the big screen. Before the studio officials gave the actor the opportunity to portray the Marvel superhero, he lobbied for the character ceaselessly for years. Sadly, the idea was abandoned after seeing the test footage. However, some time later, the same film was inexplicably leaked to the public, and since fans enjoyed what they saw, the first Deadpool movie was made. The actor has the following to say on the late night show with Jimmy Fallon in 2016, the actor acknowledged to the host that one of the four people participating in the production had to have released the clip. Four people, including the screenwriters Rhett Reese and Paul Wernick as well as the director Tim Miller, he said, could have leaked the test footage. He explained in a funny way that they had debated whether or not to leak it to the public. We all agreed from the outset that someone should leak it, so the idea was planted, but I'm 70% certain it wasn't me, Ryan continued. Fox management ordered a test clip of Deadpool for the public in 2012. Before the MCU was given a meager budget to produce a brief text reel to realize his concept for the movie, Tim Miller was renowned for creating a number of animated shorts for Marvel Studios with an Iron Man theme. Sadly, the concept was rejected, nevertheless, in 2014, it was leaked online, which led the company to rethink its stance. Reynolds played Deadpool and Wolverine in 2009, but that was a far different Deadpool from the one we've grown to know and love. In actuality, Rayon concurred, admitting that he believed it's the wrong version. I was already committed to the Deadpool movie, the actor admitted to presenter Jess Cagle during his appearance on Sirius XM Radio. At that time, a script hadn't yet been written. But then that happened, and I was essentially told, play Deadpool in this movie or else we'll get someone else to, he explained. I just responded, I'll do it, but this is the wrong version. One of the most popular and well-known superhero film franchises is the Deadpool series. Hugh Jackman's Wolverine will appear in the upcoming third part of the movie, which might mark a turning point for both Reynolds and Deadpool.